And now it's time for the holy grail of saxophone for both performers and collectors, the remarkable Conosan. This instrument has so many innovative and unique features, has such an unexpected and stunning sound, and is weird in any number of ways, that it is surrounded by a mystique that is only heightened when seen and heard. The Kano sax was introduced in 1928 and was advertised for a very brief time. It is unlike any saxophone ever made. In their advertising, Kahn claimed that the Kano sax played like a saxophone, looked like a hepaphone, and sounded like an English horn. And you know, it wasn't just advertising hype. In many ways, it is a perfect description. Kahn attempted to create a new voice for the saxophone. Its innovations are numerous. A straight instrument with a pronounced bulb-shaped bell, reminiscent of the English horn. And while most saxophones are in the key of E-flat and B-flat, the Kano sax is pitched in the key of F, the same key as the English horn and the French horn. It comes with a custom mouthpiece and incredibly features an extended key range from low A all the way up to high G. It's the greatest range of any saxophone even today. The result is a timbre, a visual experience, and a technical versatility unique to all of the saxophones. And it was visionary for its time. Conosac succeeded brilliantly as a new instrument in America, but ultimately failed in the marketplace. It was marketed as a novelty instrument, an industry for vaudeville, at a time when vaudeville was in precipitous decline. In the advertisements for the instrument, it showed people playing it in unusual dance-like and novelty and exotic positions. And it was clearly for a market that was to show something new and different. But it was introduced at the cusp of the Great Depression, and it was also expensive for its time. And since it was keyed in F, it was entirely impractical. There was no music written for it. Its demise was swift. Advertising stopped after only six months, and it was relegated to the back of the con catalogs of the 1930s, available only on special order. We know only of 25 con saxes left today. 